So we made it to Vlogmas Day 31. It was a fun month. I'm really glad I participated. I didn't quite make the goal of a video per day. There were two days that I missed. One was yesterday and I had an idea of what I was going to do all day and then it got to be the evening and I was getting ready for bed and I was like, I never did a video today. <laughs> it just totally slipped my mind. It was one of those weird ones and then I was like, I'm not going to pull out the camera when it's dark and try to make a video just to make a video. So I missed yesterday and then I also missed one day uh, last week where I, it was one of the days that I did um, one of the food prep videos. Those are really labor intensive because of course I'm doing all the food prep and then there's a lot of video that goes along with it and then a lot of editing and then they're usually longer videos so they take longer to upload. They take longer to proof, make sure there's nothing wrong with them and then they take longer to upload onto YouTube. And so by the time I got it finished and uploaded, it was close to midnight. So I did get it done for that day but I figured since it was almost midnight when I posted it that I was gonna take the next day off and I did um, so that was good but I just figured that long one counted for both days I did um, you know all but two days so I'm happy with that I'm gonna call that a win for vlogist it definitely was a lot of work to do all of those videos but it was a lot of fun and it worked out because our August was you know pretty mild we didn't have a lot of activities and things we were running off to every day but starting next week early September things are gonna start getting crazy uh, I have to do all of our prep for going on vacation um, we'll be gone for a week to the beach and then I'm gonna be home for a week after that and then I'm gonna be gone for another week uh, flying to Texas for my brother's wedding so um, our September is just gonna be nuts so don't expect a video every day in September although I really do want to take you guys along on our vacations um, and I have the Zycon Fresh order that's coming in. I definitely am gonna do a video on that. So you can see how that all works. So I have a lot of things that I wanna do in September but it will um, definitely not be every day like I did in August. Then there are a couple other things that I wanted to mention in this chat video. First is I posted a video a few weeks ago asking for questions for my husband. Um, I wanted to interview him and uh, answer all of your pressing questions that you have for him, but it didn't work out to interview him on the day that I thought I was going to, and he has been so crazy busy. I mean, he's always crazy busy, but then right now he's extra busy because he's trying to get everything done that he needs to get done so he can actually take a week off for vacation, which with his kind of job um, and with my job as a stay-at-home mom, it's like in order to take a vacation, you have to basically do double the work ahead of time or double the work afterwards. You don't actually get a vacation time off. You just have to do the work in advance or afterwards. Um, so anyways, that's what he's doing right now. And I wasn't able to get uh, the questions asked when I wanted to, but we are planning on sitting down and doing that while we are on vacation. So I have all the questions. I think I have like close to 50 questions. I know there are some duplicates in there, but I have a lot of great questions for him. And I appreciate you guys um, asking those. You asked a lot of great questions and I'm really excited to see uh, and to hear his answers. I think that'll be a lot of fun. So you can look for that sometime coming in September. Then the last thing, um, when I posted that video the other day of the sneak peek of the Instant Pot cookbook, I had a great response from you guys. I know a lot of you guys are really excited about that cookbook. And a lot of you mentioned that when you saw the video pop up that you thought it was gonna be my Instant Pot cookbook and that I was releasing my own Instant Pot cookbook. And I was very flattered by all of you that said that because it just means that you value what I do and um, that you would like, you would like that like that there would be such a great response if I were to put out a cookbook so I wanted to touch on that real quick I don't have any plans to do any kind of cookbook ebook anything like that in the near future as a stay-at-home mom of four kids I'm homeschooling four kids my husband works a ton so I do a lot of I mean I do probably 98% of the child care um, for our four kids I am just the primary the primary caretaker of the kids and I have to take care of my husband because he's working so much to support the family that I have to do all the cooking for him and all the laundry and all the cleaning. Um, that's just, that's my role, that's what I have taken on and he has taken on two very demanding, very physical jobs so we're happy with the arrangement but it's a lot of work that I have to do on a daily basis 
And the way that I'm able to make my channel work and actually have a channel is that I am filming and making videos about what I'm already doing. So as a stay-at-home mom, I clean, I cook, I meal plan, I grocery shop, all that kind of stuff, and I take videos while I'm doing the things that I need to get done. I don't have time to take on new projects and film those, like something separate. Um, basically my day is filled <laughs> completely. And so anyways, if I were to try to take on the task of creating a cookbook or creating an ebook or anything like that, it just, it just wouldn't work. It would be too much. And I'm very um, cautious of taking on too much and um, even like I'll get requests for product reviews and um, different things like that and it's just like I'm super choosy about what I accept as um, work just because as soon as someone else outside of me is requiring something of me um, in a certain time frame or whatever it just adds that extra stress and my life is stressful enough um, as a mom of four kids and I just don't I just can't take any more of the stress so um, anyways Doing a cookbook is not something that I have on my agenda at the time because that would be something separate and that would be um, just a whole a whole new thing, which I'm not ready for. So the good news for you though is that anytime I do make a recipe or create something, it's always going to be free. I'm never going to charge for any of my recipes. They're always going to be free on my YouTube channel. That's my goal. I have, I have no plans to make any paid content at all. YouTube gives me money for, you know, having ads on my videos, which I'm grateful for. You guys support me through using my affiliate links like on Amazon or Zycon Fresh or Custom Collagen, and that helps me make a little bit of money here to help support our family and to kind of offset some of the costs of making the videos and just a little bit for, you know, my time making the videos because it does take some work to edit and do all that stuff. But um, that's that's all that I need. I'm not out to make a whole bunch of money through this YouTube video or YouTube channel. It's not really the avenue to do that, and that's just not uh, where my heart is at and why I do it. So, anyways, I do really appreciate all of your sweet comments though, and asking me to make a cookbook, and um, it just made me feel really good that you guys think I could do that and that you would be interested if I were to do that and there may be a day when the kids are grown and gone that that will be something that's an option for me but right now in this season of life I've just got to focus on the kids I have at home and the work that I have to do at home and I'm really happy that I have this uh, platform to be able to share all of that with you guys and that I can just have this community and have this place to offer what I have to offer in this season of life. Um, and I appreciate you guys who watch and who just take advantage of it and give me great ideas and support. I just, I just love having this YouTube channel and I appreciate all of you guys so very much. So last thing I wanted to mention before I finish out this video is I am going to be doing that Instant Pot Cookbook giveaway. I have the book right here. I'm going to be filming that video right after this one, so definitely look for that, and I will be getting that given away to somebody very soon. Thanks so much for watching, guys, and thanks so much for supporting my channel. I appreciate you guys very much.